Hey guys, it's here, Earth 2, and today we're the Leapin Lego Link Star Wars UCS Naboo Starfighter. So, this is the box here. So, uh, it's a really big box for, uh, you know, the piece count. So, it's recommended for just 9 up, comes with 197 pieces, and is set 05060. And, yeah, so... Uh, they copy everything, uh, but you got Star Clan here, and yeah, uh, you got the Ultimate Collector series, and also Ultimate Collector series in another language. I, and I believe this is uh, French or something, something like that, I guess. But yeah, and you got the Nut Boo stuffer, and yeah, so the top here, uh, you got the handle, handle thing, and you know, just nothing else, I guess. But yeah, so this is the side and the bottom and also uh, the other side. So nothing else really on the other side. But uh, this is the back, shows you uh, the features. And you also got like, they show you everything like uh, twin laser cannons, uh, the, the astromech groid, uh, the engine and also proton torpedoes and yeah so that's uh, pretty much it for the box so inside does comes with uh, this crate here which you know uh, it's pretty common and yeah uh, that's it so this is the instruction manual here so uh, uh, they only print it only here and the other side here is just the black and you know just some I guess Star Wars things, I guess. But yeah, so inside uh, you got this pretty nice, uh, pretty cool back background here. But it's just, uh, uh, you know, you can just easily follow the build. And yeah, but this is the back, nothing else really. So yeah, that's it for the instruction. So the extra pieces is uh, very simple actually, you just got this uh, wedge piece and also uh, four, actually four Technic Axles, but I only got three of them here, but you know, just, uh, just comes with uh, extra pieces, I'm not sure if I put it wrong or something, but I don't think so. So this is the build itself here, so I will show you the stand later, but yeah, so let's start off by taking a look at the ship, of course. So, uh, the chrome pieces here is just all right here uh, on both sides, and also these pieces. Uh, actually, this th whole thing is actually, uh, I believe it's one piece, and you got this piece over here as well. And uh, yeah, so you, you got uh, some stickers here. And yeah, they are not aligned perfectly, so yeah, that's uh, kind of bad because Leapin has uh, this, like this uh, sticker quality for this set is not very good. So that's kind of a problem there, but you know, uh, this yellow piece is also very hard to stick. So yeah, but the side here, so you can see you got this transparent blue uh, Technic piece, which is nice to get. and. Uh, these things here, they are very easy to kind of spin, so yeah, uh, you have to align it like this to you know, make this thing look better. And also, uh, right here, you can see this here is not very, it's not aligned so well, so it's a bad job by Leaf in there, and it's also happened to both sides, and it is also happened to, uh, I guess, like uh, quite a lot of the of the buyers for this set so yeah that's a really bad job by leap in there but yeah the copy area uh if you see uh the pictures it is like some black piece which is yeah, it's, uh, it's also another terrible job made by leap in and yeah so uh, you got the sticker right there as well and you know you got some words there and also a red uh, marking and also on the astromech droid uh, you got this an another sticker there and also you got the r2 astromech droid hit which you know of course because this this uh, is supposed meant to be the uh, the ship that anakin skywalker used during the naboo battle so yeah but uh, the r2d2 astromech hit is you know pretty nicely printed 
and yeah it looks great but yeah this thing does spin but yeah it's really loose so if you if you shake around this thing this thing will just fall off immediately so yeah that's a really big problem there but yeah so uh you got these uh pose kind of pieces or like antennas kind of pieces right here in yellow so that's cool and yeah also another sticker here and uh the back here uh this thing is also easy e very easily uh detachable so that's kind of problem there but yeah uh it's very easily det detachable in like these kind of these kind of parts but i uh put uh Technic axle inside so that it won't fall off so easily, but you just connect it to connect it to there and Yeah, on the other side, it's just uh, pretty much the same So at the bottom here, uh, you also got a, a proton torpedo launcher Which is a sticker, but the coloring tone doesn't really match with it. So uh, that's a kind of bit problem with the sticker and yeah, the bottom is uh, nothing else interesting really, so yeah, that's it for the ship. So the stand here, uh, you, you can see uh, you got this uh, specification plate here, which you know, just got all the info, uh, just like the official LEGO one, except you got the Star Plan over there, which you know, official LEGO is uh, Star Wars, and yeah, so the stand here just got a lot of these things poking out, and yeah, this ship uh, is just uh, is just rest on here. But if you remove it, uh, these pieces will come off of it. So yeah, that's gonna be a problem. But you can turn this thing around. But yeah, the ship can't really turn around, or or else it will fall off because it has to be in the center of the gravity. But yeah, uh, this thing you can also move it around if you want to as well. But yeah, that's uh, really it for the stand. So, collusion of this set, well, I think uh, the, the set here itself is great. The chrome pieces, they are great. And, you know, it's nice that Leapin made a set that came out a long time ago because uh, it is quite expensive uh, right now. So, yeah, I guess it's nice to get it. But the quality control of this is, like, really bad. So... Yeah, I'm not, sh I'm not sure if I can recommend this, but yeah, if you really want this set, I do recommend you getting it, but uh, if you hate bad quality control, then yeah, do I do not recommend you getting this. And also, these Technic pieces right here and also on the back as well, they are very easy to fall off. And uh, this thing here was supposed to be black, the cockpit piece was supposed to be full black and you know with a different kind kind of coloring tone on it but Leapin just made made it like that so yeah that's also now a problem and yeah I believe um that the all these problems here are on quite a lot of the batches so yeah I'm not sure if I can re I can recommend this for the quality control of it but the set itself I I do like it and yeah but you know uh if you want to solve these problems, just don't touch it because it's just a UCS set, which you know, uh, UCS set was supposed to get just display anyway. So yeah, you probably won't even touch it. So you know these problems should be fine if you just display it. And yeah, so uh, buy for this down in the description box below, along with all my social media pages down in the description. So if you enjoy physical alternative bricks, I'll put a link down in the description box below as well. But thanks for watching, I'll be seeing you very soon.